There he is, Geist. Got some serious chops. He was nicked down the 80-minute man from the Denver Barbarians in their national championship run. Never say die, never left the field, of course. All hot, New England. My name is Evan Geist. I grew up in Denver, Colorado, and I moved to Boston uh, beginning of 2019. I'm a fisherman, an artist, a husband, a soon-to-be father, and a professional rugby player. It wasn't until my senior year of high school in the spring when I picked up a rugby ball. Um, I didn't get it at all uh, at the PE class, uh, but once we started going out to some trainings, um, I kind of fell in love with the game because in other sports I was kind of good at everything, but not great at any part of it. In rugby you could succeed at being that sort of consistent uh, rock, you know, you didn't necessarily have to run a 4-3-40, you didn't necessarily have to jump out of the gym, you just had to kind of put your head into the spokes and try your best and be consistent, and that's kind of where I fell in love with the game because I thought I could succeed uh, with consistency. Yeah, uh, Evan, what, what can I say, he's uh, been, been really impressed with his skill set so far, uh, he looks like he's really comfortable playing on an edge and uh, obviously can mix it up in the tide as well, so going to be a pretty big year for Evan, a uh, pretty competitive spot in our team, uh, the loose forwards. Um, I think his adaptability is, is going to help him though, um, obviously he can play a bit of 6, 8 and 7. So I'm pretty excited about what he can bring and he's a pretty composed character, um, but obviously he's got a wee bit of darkness to him with his, uh, you know, his tattoos all over his body and he loves heavy metal, so as long as we can bring that part of him out in games, I think it's going to be pretty good. So leading up into preseason, I was just training a lot with, uh, with Jared at flight. And he had actually built a home gym during COVID, so I was able to go there and stay consistent. But um, so far, the preseason has been an unbelievable challenge uh, with our new coach. Uh, is very detailed. Uh, he's unlike a coach I've ever experienced. Um, so I constantly feel mentally, physically um, uncomfortable, uh, but it's been good. You know, it's been a challenge. Uh, I can already feel my body progressing, my mind progressing. I have loved meeting the new guys. Uh, you know, we have a great crew this year. Um, and the bonding has been awesome, even though it's all been kind of virtual when it comes to that. Um, you know, you can't go hang out and stuff, but um, my hopes for the year, one of my main hopes is to stay healthy so that I can continue to compete. And then two is competing. That's my motto for the year. In preseason, compete every day, wake up, go to the weight room, compete, go to the, uh, the session and compete. You know, it's against your friends and stuff, but you know, you actually want to take their jersey or whatever. And um, you know, when the season starts, uh, competing against you know other teams but also you know I'm just fighting for a jersey spot you know on the roster so uh, that's my main goal um, to compete for that and then if I get the chance to go out there uh, compete against other guys in the MLR and uh, try to prove to myself that um, I can do it and then you know get the free jack some wins.